Hey guys. Well, we've got the pool house table, pallet table, I guess we should say. Uh, we've got it, we got a coat of polyurethane on it, so it's getting to be done here and stuff. So, so this was the pallets that I took apart and just screwed them on there. We got about, I think 46 inches wide, probably about seven feet long. I think right at seven feet long. Uh, painted the legs black to match the chairs. Well, they, they were green and I painted, put a coat of green, black paint on them. We got some gray cushions to match the other furniture here. And turned out really well. I mean, so far, let's see. The cushions, I think, were, I want to say $24.99. So we have $100 in cushions. And that's my only cost in the table. Because yeah. we already had the chairs, uh, pallets, all pallet wood. And I already had, I put a thin coat of polyurethane on it. Um, and as you can see, it turned out pretty well, but a pallet table. And I was gonna screw up from the under the bottom, but man, that was just too difficult to get them all together and everything, get the joints good and tight, so I just screwed everything down from the top. Uh, it's nice and sturdy. But a pallet table zero cost other than the cushions for the chairs I said i tried to match the the furniture over here that we built for the pool house which is coming along really well we finished that little wall off um in my bathroom over there we've got it framed off let's see i could not get no more siding this d-lap siding that i put on the other sides so I went, I had some of this uh, hemlock beetle lumber. I was saving it for a special occasion, but I went ahead and just put this on because like I said, I can't get the siding. Uh, my gosh, all the manufacturers are just out of it. And I had this, so I just went ahead and done it. And I want to get this project knocked out. I got enough to do my bathroom walls. So we'll be starting on the kitchen here for long, uh, but that is my table guys made out of pallets like i said i was fortunate enough to find some good long pallets and uh, uh it really looks good i mean it's it's really a good sturdy table um no cost in it other than my cushions but like i said it's an easy project i mean you know look at the other parts but i mean you know it's just two boards here sandwiched together to make an L and that was your legs. And then we just braced in around it, screwed it good and tight, put about four side supports going this way and just screwed to it. Excellent. I mean, it's a good and strong table. Uh, we've already had several card games around here, eat several, several lunches. And I'll tell you what, it, it's really, really nice. I'm gonna put another coat of polyurethane on it, I'm out of it uh i've been using this never used it before but it's not bad using that uh minwax spray on polyurethane it turned out pretty well i had a half a can of that left over from another little project so i thought i'd give it a try i actually like it so i'm gonna go ahead and get another can and and use it but a pallet table guys I mean, you could make it nice enough to take inside and use it use it indoors, but it's just our outdoor table. Easy, easy project. Uh, you know, scale of one to 10, 10 being you're gonna build the pyramids, one you can't tie your shoes. Oh gosh, I'm gonna say a one. That's, that's how simple, you know, the, all I did was I had a, a my, screw gun and a, a skill saw and a little speed squire and that was it and a measuring tape and that was all the tools it took me about i'm going to say an hour to complete it well an hour to take the pallets apart 
hour of sand and an hour of construction. But you know, for as far as construction, about an hour. And it's a nice, nice little piece. It matches my furniture really well. Uh, we're probably gonna do a little coffee table right here to match that table. But a pallet table, guys, uh, if you ever wanted to do one, I highly recommend it. So everybody have a great day. See ya.